not too long ago in Houston, Texas, a sister by the name of Denisha Lewis, who also goes by the name of Callie Cakes on Instagram, had an unfortunate altercation with a wannabe police officer. She said for whatever reason that David Tupper was uh, riding around on his motorcycle, I guess, I don't know, blocking traffic or something. And he also had a gun on his hip. Well, when it was time to, you know, move and she kind of lightly tapped on her horn, he did not like that. And so he stopped dead in front of her. And so she went around him and he sped up and punched and broke her mirror. So, uh, you know, it sounds like he was brake checking her and all that other stuff as well. So finally he went on about his business and they being our uh, Denisha and her son saw him at a 7-Eleven. So she went over there to confront him about what he did to her car. And this is what happened. Check it out. You are trash. Okay. Okay. Right. Keep talking. I will. Okay. Fuck with me, you classic. What you gonna do? I, I tell you what. You I'm a stupid daddy. Yeah, I'm a she stupid is. He hit my plate. I'm a stupid It's your car. And stop honking at people when you don't need Such to. A so as you saw there, we bleeped it out. He called her everything but a child of God, including the N word and some other stuff that again, we will not uh, let you guys hear. But nevertheless, up until uh, that day, people were wanting to know who he was and it didn't take long. Sounds like it took about four hours for people to get on the case and then again, discovered that he is David Tupper. Sounds like he is some sort of a security guard working for a Verintegra security company. He used to be a law enforcement officer somewhere, but nevertheless, doesn't sound like he was in his official capacity that day. Now, at this moment, there is a press conference going on with uh, Quanell X and they are trying to get him fired amongst a whole host of other things for his very racist tirade. But y'all want to know what the real gag is? The real gag is he's married to a black woman, a very black woman at that. He's booed up in pictures with her and all that other stuff. And so my thing is, does he talk to her that way? Does she know he feels that way about black women? Like what's really going on? And is she going to stay with him? Like, I, I'm curious to know what her response is. But see, let me tell y'all something here. Sisters, and I'm not talking to y'all, I'm talking to them over there, okay? There's a lot of sisters that like to run around, you know, with white dudes talking about, oh, he's so much better, this, that, and the other. Well, as we can see, he's not. Now, who's to say that's the first time that he's done that to a black woman? This is probably the first time that he's gotten caught so again, does his very black chocolate, beautiful wife know that her husband is out there treating black women that way? I hope that this is a surprise to her as well. But nevertheless, hopefully David Tupper gets what's coming to him because nah, you can't, you know, run around doing black women like that. And what was you doing in the middle of the street anyway? Like, what were you doing? Don't sound like you was really supposed to even be doing that. You're a security guard, for God's sakes. You're not a police officer. And I didn't hear anybody say that there was an immediate need for him to be stopped in the middle of the street pretending like he was doing something. So anyway, we're going to follow the story and see what happens. But yeah, hopefully he gets what he's got coming to him. And sister, hey, sister, uh, Mrs. Tupper, if you out there and you watching this, you got a lot of things on your plate. A lot of things to think about because you are truly sleeping with the enemy. So anyway, for more insightful commentary, please subscribe to this channel and my channel, The Demetri K Show, here on YouTube. Peace.